Hello and welcome to this new section in the React series and in this section we will be building a recipe application which looks something like this. So this is a fully fledged recipe application in which you could go ahead search for a specific recipe. So for example here I have searched for pizza and if you search for pizza it will kind of fetch all of these recipes from an external API. So you will get the different types of recipes for pizza and let's say if you want to know how to make a thigh pizza you could simply click on view recipe and if you click on that one it will actually give you the details about that particular recipe so for example this thigh pizza could be cooked under 45 minutes it serves three people it's a non-vegetarian item and it will also calculate the total cost of every serving as well not just that but you'll also be able to fetch the different ingredients which are required so for example for making that pizza you need two cups of all-purpose flour, you need broccoli, and it will also display the images of those ingredients as well. And after that, at the bottom, it will also fetch the instructions which are actually required to make that particular recipe. So here are the instructions listed out for that recipe. And also, if you want some pasta recipes, you could search for pasta. And as you can see, the recipes over here have changed. So let's say you want a recipe for pasta with tuna, you could simply click on view recipe and over here on the right hand side, you will be able to have the name of the recipe, the image, the prep time, the per serving, all the ingredients which are required for making this pasta along with the images and you'll also be able to get the instructions for that particular recipe as well. So let's click on some other recipe here and as you can see, as soon as you click that, now the ingredients list, the recipe, the image, everything up over here has now changed. So this is the application which we will be building in this particular section and it will cover a lot of React concepts like learning how to make a call to an external API using the use effect hook. So till this point we have not learned about the use effect hook so we are going to cover that. We will be covering the different types of components as well. So we will be learning what are structural components and how to lay out our application structure using structural components. We will also learn the concept of prop drilling as well, which allows us to pass information from one component to other component. Now, this is just a basic overview of the application. We will still be adding a lot more features to this app as we go ahead in this course. So we will also learn about using component composition. We will also learn how the lifecycle of a component works. We will also learn how to use async functions for our application to load some asynchronous data. So we will be learning all of this in this particular section, which will consist of around 30 to 40 videos. So from the next lecture onwards, let's go ahead and let's start building this application entirely from scratch. So thank you very much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you.